This is David, and I'm going to demonstrate how to do face swapping using Midjourney's new M painting tool, or what they call Very Region. So, first of all, you want to go to your settings and make sure that you have Remix mode turned on. And then I'm going to use a previously generated um, text prompt. So this is just a three shot, three characters, and a medieval tavern. In some cases it does uh, generate only two characters, but the one on the right side looks good. So let's go ahead and upscale that. Okay, what you want to do is you want to select very region and then you have a, a pop-up text or editor and so this is the undo button this is a rectangular selection button if you make a mistake you can just hit the undo this is the lasso select uh, which i find is a little bit tricky to use so we're just going to use the rectangular selection button and we're going to go ahead and select the center character space. And I'm going to use a, a combination of a image prompt and a text prompt. I'm also going to give a weighting of two for the image. I'll hit submit. And then one thing you should notice is I use the shortened for form of the image prompt. If you maybe select a uh, image in Discord, copy link, and then you try to paste it in, you'll get a really long URL. In order to get it, generate the small text, the shortened text prompt or image prompt, you can just submit it as a uh, using Imagine. Okay. So here you, we've generated four images. Let's go ahead and choose the bottom right side. And um, to give you a sense, this is the image prompt that I use. Let's go ahead and delete that. And that's kind of interesting, isn't it? Um, we've upscaled that image. So now we're going to go ahead and select the right face like this. Get rid of this. And this is another image prompt and text prompt combination with an image weight of two. And this is the uh, second image prompt that I used. Okay, it's rendering. So we look at the images. Let's go ahead and maybe select the third one. Upscale it. And then for the left character space, I'm going to use a combination. Let's go ahead and select his face. And then I'm going to use a um, character um, uh, reference in McClellan as Gandalf. Uh, what I find is this helps to maintain character consistency. And this is uh, what the um, image prompt looks like. We'll go ahead and submit it. So fingers crossed. OK, 
Okay, we've got four new images. Let's choose the one upper on the upper right. Okay, so that looks good. So what we can do as well is we can zoom out on this image. We can make it square, but very strong and very subtle uh, do not work once you went ahead and done this face swapping. Um, try something, maybe we can um, pan up would be interesting. So this is a zoom out. This is, uh, we made it square. So those look good. And this is the zoomed out. This is a square image. It's interesting, they put some text in these when we did a pan up. So again, this is the resulting image. I'm gonna drag that over here and let's look at the initial image So that's the initial image, and the, that's with the faces swapped. So there you go, face swapping using M-Painting in Mid-Journey.